Okay, this is Andy Graham of my Grand Bassam. I'm at a place called Hotel La France. Um, as best I could tell, it, it may have been built in the 1900s. What we have kind of identified is that uh, there's some corner bricks that are exactly the same as the Second Empire building. And whether they're before 1893 or after 1893, we don't know. Uh, we're still trying to put together all these pieces. I'm going to take the camera and walk you around. Uh, there's this is the Hotel La France. Okay, so that's what everybody calls it. And there's absolutely nothing here that says absolutely that we're positive that that's Hotel La France. Other than this one is probably built more like a hotel than, so I, I would surmise that it's probably true. There is a sign up here that says Hotel La France. But there's many boys here that do all sorts of different kind of unscrupulous things trying to sell tourists down the road to agree with them to do stupid things. What's interesting about this is it has the balconies. It's got three floors, which is definitely, of course, probably a colonial type property. Uh, it's, I want to point out the corner brick here because this has the same corner brick as the uh, the building, the Second Empire building that I was showing you. I'm going to show you around the back. The, the back way is really interesting because uh, maybe I'll take two or three videos of this trying to show you. But uh, what's interesting here, if I can get a good view, is there's a, a building back here, which who knows what it is exactly. It could have been uh, a cooking quarters. I mean, in the in the past, and they would have a cooking quarters separated from the living quarters. And you really didn't have toilets inside and things like that. That was considered relatively uncivilized. But you see that bridge going across from one building to the other building? So there's probably a second story up here on top of here. But it doesn't look like there was ever any concrete thing. So I'm suspecting that this was some kind of a place to bring in a carriage or horses or cars maybe even, I don't know. But uh, it's quite an interesting set of steps in the back. Um, is it original? Who knows? But this is the Cort Corte France. Now the bricks here do appear on this building a little bit different than the bricks over here on this. Um, I'll walk you around the other side. It's got balconies all the way around it and it's behind this is in between actually almost in the middle between the the actual ocean and the lagoon maybe I can uh, walk inside here my camera will focus it's just a beat up old entranceway Again, this has a uh, uh, joist in it, but they're actually going horizontal as with a normal joist in it, so it does have steel in the, in the building. And I'm possibly taking newer builder, buildings and not the older buildings. Uh, a lot of times the buildings uh, had really nice doors on it, then people came and stole all the nice doors and replaced them with the cheap doors. So anything wood is has problems and maybe in the past they had wood steps going up to these different places. Uh, as you can see on each corner, normally a set of steps would be on the corner on the ends of each building so you could go up to the next flight. Uh, there's an interesting building just to the, to the left of this, which seems to be related, although I don't know how. So you can see that this building is got a little pathway next to it. So they look to be constructed at the same time. Hey, I have some friends. And, but, but maybe I'll take some more videos of the Hotel La France and try to show you in the future. How are you? I'm good, how are you? Um, thank you.